Hey, it's so Ryan's Angel, and today I'm going to show you a virtual hub for your arcade games. Yes, a VR arcade room. It's called New Retro Arcade Neon. It's by Digital Cyber Cherries, and I just want to say thanks to them for giving me a key. I really appreciate it and letting me check out the game. Now, check out this area. This neon 80s. How cool is that? So, here you have an arcade machine to represent the menu. Nice detail on the... Look at this, you can pick everything up. Now, I'm not running this in VR. You can run it in Oculus Rift. But uh, I don't have VR, so I'm sure it's much better in VR. I'm using an Xbox One controller. So, let's check out the menu. So, check this out. An NES Zapper. How cool is that? So, you have multiplayer options customized. But right now, we're going to focus on single player. You have two versions of the arcade. You have classic version, neon version. So let's check out classic first. All right, so we're about to enter the arcade now, and I just want to say that the games you're going to see now are not the games that came with this originally. Uh, I added my own ROMs, of course, from MAME because you know I want to play the classic games I grew up with, and I found some mods online and added them. So that's what you're going to see now. So now we're going to enter the arcade, and let's check it out. Here we go. <gasps> Here come the story of a hurricane. Here come... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought I was watching Dave and confused. Alright, so here we are. Uh, you can see all the arcade machines here. How cool is this? Look, you got the previews. Look, even the sounds when you pass by the machines. Look at this. Each machine is playable. Very cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, I got a Donkey Kong right here. Originally, a Frogger was here. The original mod didn't include Donkey Kong, which I thought was blasphemy. Donkey Kong's one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, I can't get the video to work on this one, though, or the sounds, but I'm working on it. Uh, then you got these mini games. It's like Dave and Buster's uh, or Grand Prix Racerama, where you can, you know, get your tickets and buy stuff, get like a thousands of tickets to buy like a pen <laughs> and then they put like a, a PS4 and an Xbox One behind glass and it says like 10,000 tickets or something to get it <laughs> you can play uh, darts here uh, you can also play uh, SNES games here you can watch uh, movies uh, here's a Miss Pac-Man machine uh, let me see I'm gonna check it out uh, okay Put my corner in, and here we go. I like the little stick moves. There's the arcade stick. Look at that. It's really cool. I'm sure this is much cooler in VR, but it's still cool. So yeah, we got uh, this Pac-Man here, and this pressing escape takes you back to the original menu. Uh, you can play bowling over here. Uh, this is pretty hard to do with the Xbox One controller. I'm trying, but I can't. <laughs> Wait. Damn. <laughs> it wasn't even open yet. Wait. <laughs> Wait. There we go. There we go. Ah. Oh, damn. Can I push it? <laughs> Get in there. What if I bowl from here? There we go. Wait. <laughs> Where is it going? Hold on. Here we go, here we go. What? Stop it. It keeps going backwards. Wait. There we <laughs> I can't even get from here. Come on. God, you don't understand how hard these controls are with the Xbox One. It just uh Let's 
try another game. Oh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> Let's kick shell. Let's kick shell. Let's get shell. Big Apple, 3 a.m. Whoa, whoa. Awesome. Oh look, a bottle. <laughs> there's a lot of little details here too. Look, there's a, uh, wait, let's play some darts. Wait, hold on. Ooh, not bad. Whoa, did I just get a bullseye? Oh, <laughs> I was like, I wasn't even trying. I was like, oh my God, if I got a freaking bullseye. Oh. Oh, did I? <laughs> Oops. Come on. Ah. See, it's so hard. That's why I was like, if I got a bullseye earlier, this is impossible. Wait. Okay, look, there's an etch. Oh, yeah, you can also play Game Boy games. Which is cool. Oh, drop my Game Boy. I was going to play, you can play uh, etch a sketch. Damn. I keep dropping it. There we go. Look. Edge a sketch. I always loved this as a kid. Okay, that's enough of that. Wait, where'd that Game Boy go? Oh, you can put cassettes there in the radio too and hear music. It's a pain though with the Xbox One controller. This really is for meant for VR. So yeah, you can play uh, some Game Boy games here. You can also add your own uh, cards, like ROMs, if you want, so that's cool. Uh, I don't think I put a game in there. Uh, we could try uh, Donkey Kong. There's something wrong where it says 1-up high score, it's stretched out if you notice. Bottom is stretched out too, I just noticed. I'll have to fix that out, figure it out. So, what's over here? Uh, these doors are locked. There's an extra arcade game machine. Now, this is the classic uh, arcade. Game, so, uh, let's. Uh, oh, yeah, you can also ha change all this, but I'll explain that later when I show the tool creator. But, um,. Let's check out the Neon Arcade. Let's get out of here. Bye. All right, now we're gonna check out the Neon Arcade. I think this one is much better. Here you got your soda machine. Get a Pepsi. What does that say? No, Peppy. Peppy! Don't want your Peppy. Got some movie posters there. You can get some change. Uh, the wet floor sign. <laughs> uh, some gumball machines. I don't think you can use these, though. So, here we are in the Neon, Neon Arcade. Uh, this one has two floors. Samurai Showdown. Oh, yeah, they have, uh... Is called again? Ski ball? I always forget the name of this. I used to play this when I was younger. Again, it's very hard to play with the Xbox One controller. I, I just I can't get the hang of this. I think if I throw it high, it makes it easy. Again, the basketball machines here. Basically, all the same stuff is here. It's just uh, there's more to do and more stuff to see. You got the bowling alley. You got games here. Oh yeah, there's a whack-a-mole. Whack-a-mole. Uh, in here is a movie theater. Here you can watch YouTube clips or whatever uh, website you linked it to. 
You can add your own movie. There's a projector. I still have to do all that. Uh, here you got some refreshments, some treats, like donuts, some beverages. <laughs> Over here we got the VIP room. You can play air hockey another player uh, this I think is an original game called zombie 2 problem uh, oh yeah there's a guitar how do you play this Rock out! Woo! Metal! No, remember that. Pizza. Cherry pizza. Again, you got the SNES games. Let me see if I'll put a game in. There we go. Turn it on. And there we go. Donkey Kong Country. Uh, let's check out another room. We got the movie theater room there. Uh, there's also this awesome arcade builder that lets you build your own arcade, add your own ROMs, add your own posters, tapes, music, radio stations, uh, VHS tapes. You can add your own movies, YouTube clips, or links you want to use. You link all the music from um, from a website. Uh, server uh, you can add your own posters here you can add all the different ROMs see here's where all the ROMs have been added arcade machines tells you where the, the location is for each arcade machine in the physical space of the game this is a cool thing I really love it let's go to this level Got more arcade machines here. Time Crisis. Blazing Stars, a shooter. Or shmup. Uh, we got a bar here. Uh, this says coming soon. I don't know if this means we're going to add a laser tag game in the future. That would be awesome. Why do I keep getting peppy? Go back downstairs. You have your cassettes here. Where you can uh, add your own music. Uh, this thing. Come and get some. I don't know how to play this. The Xbox One. Let's see. Oh, here we go. It's the X button. Actually, that wasn't terrible. All right. Whoa, that would be a cool enemy. Uh, we could play uh, Tekken Three. So basically this is an awesome idea. Bretto, the Bret no. The Bretro. Oh, that's cool that they put that there. 
I know what that is. Let's go out. Overall, this is really, really cool if you want to have like a virtual arcade room with VR and play all your favorite classic games. And it's really cool that you can add your own stuff. So make it, you know, you can make it your own thing, which is really awesome. And I can't recommend this enough if you're into retro gaming and even if you're just like video games in general and just want to check out some uh, some old retro games and just have fun playing video games. I mean, this thing is awesome. All right, I'll see you guys later. This is Orion's Angel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.